In this video, I will be showing you how to prep pipe cleaners before using them for curls. So this is a pipe cleaner here. And everyone, keep in mind that everyone does theirs differently. So what I do is I take a pipe cleaner, this is the black one, and I fold it. But I also leave like a little, see a hair, short, just right there. Okay? And then I go ahead and make a loop at the end. I make a loop. See? I make a loop. Like a smaller loop than that probably about that much and I just go ahead and twist it all the way up this is what I do I'm going to also show you how to make a pipe cleaner um, that's longer for ladies with longer hair if you have uh, if you want to do pipe cleaners and well I'm pretty much just twisting it just like this okay all the way to the end see loop then I have this little piece this is going to be the piece that I bend over once I get to the top Okay, so here we have two pipe cleaners. What I like to do is take two and twist it at the end. Twist it. Twist it up. And then create a loop. Twist that together like that really fine. See? This is two. And then I just go ahead and twist it together like this. Now I use pipe cleaners this way if I want to do a um, curl that is, you know, a bit longer, like a, just a Shirley Temple curl hanging down. Um, but most of the time when I do my curls with pipe cleaners, I actually use shorter ones, just like the one that I showed you how to do before. This one here, and I'm going to show you guys how I do it once I show you here. But I usually use these. And I know that it's hard to believe. Like, girl, how do you get all of them long locks on this little teeny pipe cleaners? But I'm about to show you the method that I use to do that in just a minute. I'm telling you, bomb.com curls. Yeah. Wild roses as the sun begins. 